My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? Fuck that! Oh, she's on a mad thing. I knew she was crazy. Oh my god, I knew I was gonna fuck up there. What the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm worried about Lamar, you gotta help him, frankly. Wow. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. We'll go away. Let's go. In the dome. Go. Oh. Yeah. You too. What's good, man? We're back with another one. In our last playthrough, uh, Michael got back his family. Now, I don't know if that was the best thing to do, but, you know, you can't replace family, but they are dysfunctional as fuck. But he got back his family, so I'm sure he's in a better, he's in a better mindset. Now we've got to do some missions with Franklin. We have to tell one of the architects, and also we're gathering up the last little bits and pieces for the big one. The big one. So yeah, let's get into it, man. Franklin, man, I'm following the architect. All right, don't fuck it up. All right. All right, we've got to be on our super self thing now. Tell the architect and get the plans. Hey, stupid! You can't be on here without a hat. Of course, I yeah, got to wear my safety hat. What about my vest? Do I get a safety vest? Is it called a safety tonight. vest? A reflective vest? I can't get too close, right? I'm gonna spook him if I get too close. Anything we need to be worried about? Oh, okay. Worried about you so plan. we're getting the plans that Lester was, um, those idiots drilled the new case on that Lester was scouting. Side. Lester was scouting the Better plans for this uh, construction site, for the big uh, heist, right? So I'm sure once we get the plans, we can maneuver better, you know, to to get our our bonds, our money from the bank, all the trust funds, the trust funds. Do we go on the same one as them or a different one? Probably a different one, right? I mean, he still looks out of place, right? With just that helmet, <laughs> and he's uh, he's got a vest on and tracksuit bottoms. It's like a fireman um, helmet, right? Okay, we keep moving stealthily. Get the architect to give up the briefcase. Oh, so we can just beat him down now. Oh, that was easy. Help! Help! Uh, how are we meant to leave? Can we go through? You know what? We might have to do a matching still. Oh, shit. Should I have shot them? I don't know, but... Maybe. It's about to be hot either way. And I ain't got no body armor. Is, was there another way I could have done it? Uh-oh. He's about to get real. Let me get my SMG with a suppressor. We're just going to have to kill one of these police officers, you know, and get, get their, um, their cars. Fuck it. Let's be having ya. Sorry, mate. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I need your car. Is that security for them? It is. Don't, just don't shoot at the tires, please. Merci. It's a little bit of French for you if you don't know how I speak. I can only say 
Thank you and bye-bye and hello. Maybe I could have killed the guy with a knife or something so then he wouldn't have alerted the other people, right? That could have been an option maybe. Or would they have been alerted automatically anyway? I'm not sure. Ah, it's Greg. Hey, you got him? Of course I do, home. Here. Thank you. So, all good? Sure, homie. So is this shit for real? We just gonna rob the FIB and be allowed to walk by your boys like that. Yeah, I don't fucking know. Probably not. All right, Lester, what do you got? Uh, I don't quite know yet. Give me a minute. I'm not a fucking computer. All right, Lester. My bad. Oh, oh maybe I am. <laughs> Here's what I think. We have two options. The new security software goes into containment mode in case of emergency, you know, uh, earthquakes, mudslides, acts of God. So we could plant some firebombs. They go bang! The emergency call goes out. We hijack it, show up as firemen, and then we grab the containment drive. Or we could hack the system on site. We'll go in by, uh, by air. Uh, hope we don't run into too much physical resistance. Sounds relaxing. Either bombing our office ran by a division of corrupt government psychos or defeating one of the world's most complex security systems using our worthless ass ninja skills, huh? Yeah. Any, many, money, mo. Which one? If you Which favor one? the firebomb containment drive option, you'll go in with that janitor's ID you picked up. It'll be at night when most of the workers are off. You mop the place and plant the bombs where we need them. Seriously? I got a mop? Yeah, yeah, you really do. They'll clock you on the cameras if you're play acting. You also need a fire truck to show up in when the bombs go off, and a getaway car stashed in a quiet place near the bureau so you can torch the truck and get out. The car doesn't have to be anything special. There shouldn't be any heat. Well, what about the other way, with the uh, ninja skills? Now you choose that route, you won't be using the janitor's gear, but we had to cover all the bases. Your FIB paymasters will have to provide you with a chopper and a pilot. Now you fly way up above the building, parachute in, and gain access to the roof here. Now you'll need to be armed to the teeth, mind you, just in case the uh, shit goes down. Mopping or parachuting? Wow, you're making this choice really difficult. Uh, Haynes has given us the leftover money from the Polito job to pull this mission, and the crew will be paid out of that. We keep the change. So, what's it gonna be? Which one? Should we do 007, Secret Agent, or Goofy Ass? I think number A, you know? Number A, letter A, wow. Did I just say number A? It's not looking good for your boy. <laughs> Let's go with letter A. Let's go with A. a. <laughs> so you do want a mop, okay. Well, you'll need a couple of gunmen. They'll go in with you as firemen. Everything goes to plan. They won't fire a single bullet, but you will be running into a burning high-rise with them, so consider that. So I need a good gunman. Select a gunman to hire. Well, we're not taking him, even though he's cut his 7%. It's absolutely pants. Well, he's 12%. We would take him, actually. Yep, it's okay. I got a good feeling about him. Oh, we need another gunman, okay. We're gonna need the best gunman we can we can get, so we're not gonna cut corners. We're gonna go here. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Okay. That all look good to you? You are robbing the FIB here. <laughs> yes, that looks amazing. Let's go with that. And we have a winner. I'll make the arrangements and call you when we're ready. All right, shit, hit me. You know, um, I'm still looking into that Union Depository gig. It's real interesting. But I don't know if we can do it without you-know-who. Uh, well, as long as he can't do it without us. Okay. <sighs> hey, Sugar Plum. Daddy? I'm in trouble. What is it? Money? Drugs? Your mother. There's this guy. He's been following me around. I think he's about to do something. Where are you? Vinewood Plaza. Okay, wait there. 
He's been following me in my car, so let's just drive around and you can talk to him when he shows. Oh yeah, we'll talk. Daddy, come on, get in the car, let's go! Fuck me, I'm leaving this car now to get on that little piece of shit. Let's go find him. We should try over at Hawaiian Snow for him. We're looking for a guy in a purple convertible. I don't remember what make. Okay, I'll keep an eye out. Thanks, Daddy. Thanks, hey, Daddy. What dance for, huh? I mean, other than. It's not one here, right? Here? No, he's not around. We should try that motel opposite the big construction site. Where'd you meet this guy? Uh, at a signing? What are you signing? A hot petition? Well, you better not be taking out credit like your brother. Not credit. She definitely did something with this guy. You see him? I don't think so. Maybe we should look over at Cluck and Bell, Rockford Plaza. I, I was signing autographs and the expo. People want to meet you after that video on Fame or Shame? Yeah, yeah. We found this brick? Not yet. Okay, uh, how about going around the corner and back up the hill past Crockahoo? Does she know where this guy is? Or is she just handing us on a duck duck goose? With her very own stalker. You finally made it, Dad. You raise your kids in Rockford Hills. Ah! Purple car! That's him! Fuck! He's on you! Let's go! I was stuck with the stalker. Just hey, what are you the... running for, Pap? He's out of the car! I... Have I got a taser? I haven't, you know. We're just gonna have to ban him. Get it! I'm going! <laughs> yeah, you don't fuck with our daughter, man. Don't fuck oh with Michael's God, daughter. I said our daughter. Like had to, had to. You just we're gonna run over him as well. Give it a rest, love. I saved your life, man. I can't believe you did that. What? We had to be sure. I just wanted you to speak to him. This was infinitely more persuasive. I never should have called you. Look, there's a lot of sickos out there. I couldn't take the chance. I know there are sickos out there. My dad is one of them. Grow up, baby. It's time you got serious with your life. Yeah, I ain't perfect, but I love you. Thanks, Daddy. Bye. <laughs> Glad I could use my paternal rage productively for once. She just forgot about us killing him now. She's like, you killed him. You killed him. Drop her off. Thanks, Daddy. Bye. Hello, hello. Good to see you, Slick. Devin, the hell are you doing here? That piece it's of over, shit. Michael. You done good, kid. You kept this bullshit up long enough to help me trigger a fantastic insurance payout when the plug is pulled. I love you. You're you're like my spirit brother now. Where's Solomon? He's out getting the negatives of film, whatever the fuck it is. The last dinosaur in town is about to get fossilized. What are you talking about? Look, the movie's nearly done, so if the plug's pulled now, the investors, meaning us, get a massive insurance payout. Meanwhile, I can use that to get the other major shareholder, the old bastard's idiot son, to agree to tear this relic down and let me redevelop the area for condos. <laughs> and in this economy, the city's gonna let me build tax-free. I might even get some rebates. It is a brilliant thing, and it is all thanks to you and Molly's eye for the details of the insurance policy. Michael, they're fucking us. The suits, and they don't even wear suits. Wolves in turds clothing. <laughs> Try not to take it too badly, Mr. Richards. Were you ever a human being? Look, people used to like films. Now they like what? Videoing themselves, beating off on their iFruit phones. Don't blame me. I'm a very spiritual person. I feel badly about this. But evolution is evolution. Gentlemen, Molly. Namaste. Can I take the film now, Mr. Richards? My plane leaves in 25 minutes. Can't we do something? At least let me finish the picture, then close the place down. I'm afraid our timetable doesn't allow for that. Goodbye, Mr. Richards. 
Why did they let him do it? With that movie? She is taking the only copy offshore, somewhere nice and discreet. Analog. God, it's certainly got its complications. Michael, can you do something? No, he can't do anything, pal. It's an inevitability. <sighs> My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? Fuck! That I'm a For producer. Real. Nobody fucks with my film. By Yogi, I like that little okay, nickname okay. for them, though. The airport. Oh, man! Uh, let's go to the airport. Can we make it in time? Oh, hey. Fucking off. Yeah, I don't know why they just let that guy and him just walk all over. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. She's on the way to my personal hangar. Security at the airport work for me. I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with it. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am. Today, look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my move. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over. For sure, there's no need to panic. The LSPD are here to escort you to the hangar. Oh, she getting chased by the fence as well. Oh, she's on a mad thing. I knew she was crazy. I knew she was fucking crazy. There is no need to drive erratically. Please calm down. Oh my god, I knew I was gonna fuck up there. Oh wow. Oh shit, I'm gonna get caught in that. Or maybe not. Get out of there! Fuck! I fucked up my car. I've only gone and fucked up the car. <laughs> Bro, this mission is an absolute shit show. Wow. Look at that. Look at the that's wild. Yo. This Molly bitch is crazy, y'all. I think anybody called Molly though is pretty crazy, so. You're playing chicken? Oh my god. I need a motorbike or something. Because my car is finished. Look at that. How am I still going? I have no idea. Psycho car. Might have to kill her though, so where's she at? I think you need some help right now! Do you miss a shooter or no? Another man's coming! Hey, 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 hey! Oh, stop! No, we're not. Look out! Ooh! Yee! God damn. What would she call that? Lose the cops. Fucking hell, look at her guts everywhere. Can we get the plane and move? I got what I came for. I'm leaving. For real, come on. Hey, I ain't done anything. Oh, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Well, now I've done something. Let's go! Quickly, quickly! Ah, we out. Yep, I'm in your car. We out. We out of there, we out of there. With the immediate quickness. 
And I'm taking this left because I see you motherfuckers coming straight ahead. Which way can I go? Let's go this way. They're gonna just spawn though. That's the fucking thing I hate. That's what I hate the most. It's just gonna spawn. Let's go. Fuck, 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 fuck. Is there, are they underneath her? They are, isn't it? Is this guy here? Fuck it. It had to be done. Alright, let's get out of here. You've got the chopper on us now. It's going to be so difficult to lose us. But to lose them. I can't even speak. Let me focus. Focus! Oh shit. Let's go, let's put our, let's put our driving hat on. Oh my god, don't go into the fucking train. Alright, we're good now, we should be alright. Look at them, there's one right here now, fuck's sakes. Where are they coming from? Oh my god. <laughs> Me trying to get away looking at the fucking bridge. Are you fucking having a laugh, mate? Let's just stop here. They're not going to come on the railway tracks, right? Surely. We are good to go. We are good to go. Oh, let me move. See that chopper coming in. Fuck that. Beautiful. She panicked, went crazy, and ran into it. But I saved the print, so we still got our move. You believe that analog thing? It's all digital. We have backups everywhere. I mean, we're shooting on green screen. Well, you could have told me. I'm sorry. Oh, Look, I thought you knew. The all of that for nothing. Done, and we've got to get it out before they can screw us again. I've greenlit a premiere. That will stop them from burying us. A premiere? For Meltdown? Okay, can you invite my family? They can finally have something to be proud of me for. Of course! It's already on its way by Korea. All right. Oh, shit. I'll get ready. It was an American divorce, by the way. The movie quote. Obviously. The big one. Hey, how oh, you doing? That shop. Ah, pretty good under the circumstances. About to knock off a federal government building. Oh, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. Franklin got us what we need. Put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. So, I'm guessing drapes and Cindy Candle aren't going to do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. You'll have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get out, trigger the bombs, meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well... Under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you'll remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. 
But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. He's looking around like, damn, this place has been special. We've done some, we've, we've pulled some special moves here. And now it's time to pack up shop. And keep it moving, on to the next. Look at the sunset, man, beautiful. Hey, I'm on my way to the bureau. Link up with Packy and Gus, get the fire truck, and be ready for my call. All right, the dudes is pros, so this should go kind of smooth, right? Man, I have no luck. Like when it comes to like smooth transitions in the game, enter the FIB building and go to the turnstile. Okay, we take the helmet off. Yeah, when it comes to like smooth transitions in the game, like a chase or something, I'm always fucking it up. Without a doubt, I'm gonna fuck it up. Well, let's see if this option was better than the other one. I think this one is a bit more discreet, buys us more time, so it should be better. How do we enter? Is there a way to enter? Do we just break the doors? Oh, we just. You new? Just go through the turnstile. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. Okay, go to the elevator. Let's see how smooth this goes. Hopefully it goes, it goes smooth. And we can be in and out, but no in this game. It's gonna be some trouble, but we're always prepared for some trouble, so. So pick up the mop. How demoralizing is Michael gonna feel that he has to mop? Especially in the FIB building as well, because these guys are scumbags. Go to the office floor. Mop the floor, okay. So we can't alert those guys ahead, I'm assuming, or maybe they might be other janitors that know. We're not a regular here. It's dirty. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me. It's a mop again. Okay, right here. Plant the bomb in the locker. Which locker? This one there. There you go. Okay, okay, okay. We're on our stealth team. No one has a clue. Damn, I hope these people leave though, so they don't get Watch caught. Watch out, kids. You know you stay too late when the mopping dead show up. All right, all right, I'm leaving. Oh, should I've waited for him to leave before? All right, at least he washed his hands. Good hygiene. A lot of them wouldn't. Take the mop and the bucket to the closet. Another janitor? 
Was the last one a heart attack or a budget cut? When are you gonna get out of here? When I log my OT for the week. Yeah, it's not about being a second. Okay, we we in there. We we accomplished our goals, and I don't think anybody suspected suspected anything. So successful. I thought it would have been a bit more messier, but they don't work so hard. We're all leaving in a minute. Ah, we can run. Okay, let's see what's next. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Oh, we're coming in low. Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Hey, look, everybody cool, right? Because once we pick him up, it's all go, all right? I'm ready for anything. All right, let's go. We live. We live. We have to do the Dead boring parts and not do the Frank. interesting part. I'll get this turn up here on. We're meant to go. Use the phone to detonate. Oh, it's right here, right? Detonate. Ooh. Yeah, that was Mike. Lester hijacked the emergency signal, right? Yep. We'll be the only idiots running in this burning mess. But don't worry. Uh, so they should be expecting us. Alright, let's get in there. Make way for the fire department. Make way, make way. Evacuate the building. We're not going to use a lift. Elevator, are we? let's go. Oh. Come on, let's go. If All I saw right, firefighters. Getting into the elevator and the fire. Killers all that loose notory weed at the time. I'd be like, something's not right here. Cool, dog. Thanks for clearing that shit up. We gotta go across. Take the stairs to the top floor. Oh right, shit! You gotta be to precise with it. Stairwell and up to the top floor. Okay, gotta keep an eye on our oxygen levels. Make sure it doesn't get too low. I'm looking you around for loot, I don't know why. Server room's on 53. Keep going. Almost at the top. Fucking hell, you do have to be strong to do this though, innit? Can you imagine? All this smoke surrounding you and you're wearing all this gear. Yeah, it's crazy. Salute to the to the firefighters, man. Get the containment drive. What the fuck is that? Oh yeah. Oh, they're moving quick. I gotta keep up. Yeah, the door's locked. Fit a bomb and blow it. Plant explosives on the door. Shit. You see that? 
Let's go, let's go, let's go. Our oxygen is good. But these guys are fucking quick. Oh shit. Was this still the best option? Oh fuck. Top Gustavo. Let's go, no man left behind. Let's go. Oh fuck. Oh, we go straight. Wow, we fucked up the whole building. Oh shit. No way. They just left, man. That's crazy. Oh, they know we're not firemen. Okay. Well, our cover has been blown. The office was meant to be empty. Can't you see the building burn? And they're still shooting, you know. These guys are wild. What's this for me for? I thought it was going to be a smooth one. I guess not. I can't see a fucking thing, okay. There's one in here, right? Is that all of them? Right, let's keep pushing. Have we linked up with him there? Nice. Hey, we're going up this level. On me. Well, at least they waited behind, right? Go to the elevator shaft. I think if we didn't pick Gustavo or a high level gunman, yeah, it probably would just be me and Michael right now. The other two would have died. Fuck. Alright, this is our way out. We gotta get these doors open. What's up? Hey, give me a hand. Briggs, come on. I see it's tree level. I fucking hope so. Oh shit. Let's descend as far as we can. Oh fuck. Be careful. We cool. Oh fuck. The ceiling's coming in. Again. I wonder if they get you. If you're close to the wall, will they get you? Maybe not. Terra firma. Hey, let's get the fuck out this build, right? Before it comes down on our head. The truck! Come on! Get in! Get to the fire truck, okay. How they escape that is, is, is mad. It's crazy. 
Don't tell me we're going to get chased as well. It was pretty smooth, pretty right, smooth. Going. Just a few agents on the way. All right, we all gotta change before we get there. At some point soon, an APB will go out looking for firemen. We can not be playing dress up when that happens. We need to get to the ride and torch this fire truck as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute, they'll be looking for us. I mean, those guys in the building you took down. If they knew, who else is gonna know? It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Trust me. I'm gonna get us there as fast as I can. All right, check. Trust me check. to park the car. I just don't want to run into something. Man, y'all don't want to run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't want to run into. Haha, <laughs> you're right. So, uh, take us to our get out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. All right, man, I'll try. Try real hard, okay? Destroy the fire truck. Got some stickies. Throw one there. Damn. Throw one there. I think that's good enough. He's not getting a car though, fuck. Oh, you wanker! Oh, they're, they're jumping fence. The clear, I yeah. probably tell you people, I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there. But you planned the thing, right? Yeah, I chose the best of two impossible options. We had to sell them that we were firemen to start with. That's a pretty crazy task. And that's just to get the opportunity to have a high-rise fall down on us? Yeah, well, thank you kindly for being so upfront with us on how dangerous this motherfucker was. We made it, didn't we? Whole crew's intact. We're charmed, Fox. boys. We're charmed, but we're really good at this shit. <laughs> we're all professionals, know what I'm saying? Scores are easy when you ain't got to depend on no wannabes. Charmed? Yeah, that's about right. Michael DeSanta, Franklin Clinton, Gustavo Moda, and Patrick McReary. When people are talking about the time guys went into the bureau and wiped their files, man, those will be the names, the rumors. This one will go down in the ages. Yeah, man, I'm just glad this shit is over. I don't want to do nothing else for them fools no more. Nor do I, bro. I gotta swing that. Hey, you gotta swing some with Trevor, too. You should reach out, homie. I'll think about it. I'm kind of enjoying my break from him. Don't think about it too long. He might decide to act. That's all I'm saying, man. We left there, though, with no casualties. So... I would say that was successful. Oh, we here now. All right, I'm out of here. <laughs> well, what? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! <laughs> Fucking A right, we did it. <laughs> Ow. How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> Come here. Give me oh. some of that. Hey. Ow, 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 ow. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot <laughs> my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Ugh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make hmm? a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm oh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> <coughs> man, that's some foul ass shit! Oh. <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I got to go square things up with Davy and Dick uh, For serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? 
Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable. And loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you boys sure know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis. See? Davy, that's why we're such great friends, huh? We're old school. We like old-fashioned things. Newspapers. Celluloid. Good guys. Bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Thanks. Things are not gonna work out quite that way. There's a bit of a Onion. problem. That's right, Davy boy, you could say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't oh, we you? Got All right, I we got things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Steve, oh, come whoa! On, please. You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him. Not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Oh, shit. Who the fuck are you with? With me. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Put the gun down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather. What are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down. Oh, same goddamn leg. Go! Oh shit. Fuck. Bullshit. Jesus Christ! We got everyone around us. Fucking hell. Okay. Shit just got real quickly. These guys kill each other. Oh, we got to try to escape. He get caught in the crossfire. Let's fuck this him up. Oh yeah, you gone. You gone. You, you gone. So all these guys out of your ass. Is there one more? Oh him. He's still alive. Take that money, thank you. So corrupt, man. All of these motherfuckers. Oh, it's over! Thanks. I'm oh he's there, okay. Oh shit, we gotta take out that chopper. Fuck. Have we got a big boy? Trevor. One time for the one time. Oh, the fuck? Hey! If anyone's gonna kill you, old friend, it's gonna be me! Oh! <laughs> you here to finish the job, T? No, 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 no. I'm just here for the opportunity. Now run! You gotta love Trevor, man. What a fucking G. What a top two. Where's he at? Where's Dave at? We're in this together. Do me a solid T. I can help you, Trevor. You're by the reflecting pool. The reflecting pool. I can't see that motherfucker. Where's he at? He might just have to die. I can't find him. Without me, the bureau will be on you 24 hours a day. 
Where are you at, mate? I can't see ya. Oh, right here. Okay. We're in this together. Do me a solid. B. We're good. Moving up on the reflecting pole. I couldn't. I could not find him. I could not find that guy for sure. Oh shit. More below us. I thought again. you were the corrupt division. Oh my god, what is that? Fucking. Have we got the big one? Yeah. Let's use the rocket launcher. Let's use the big one. Ooh, let's go. That was beautiful. That was absolutely gorgeous, mate. Gorgeous. I'm a potato. I only said I check out the court center. Okay, there's one here. Fucking hell. I'm why am I so bent? Okay, we got one there. We got one. Stay still, please, stay still. I'm so bad. I'm so fucking bad at shooting. Oh, let's get into the meat of the bones. Oh, we had enough casualties today. Oh, we got a switch to show off. Looks like inappropriate pose. There we go. Raiding. They're done. Got another chopper. I can't use that. I Why can't I use that? My hey, thanks, oh, let me to do that. This is our shuttle. I'm making a run for the parking lot. Get clear or we'll talk. Come on, it's over here. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Put as much dirt between you and this place as you can. And do not contact me until you're absolutely sure you're clear. We got one behind us. Where is he at? Oh, right there. Okay. I'm taking this one. So long. Oh, we got okay. This motherfucker's leaving us. Be careful, Davey. Okay, no, he's meant to go anyway. Safe. Not here. Meet me behind the pawn shop in Morningwood. Alright, uh, we are. Oh, nice car though. Great. Another chopper. Oh shit. Oh! 
you know what? I've learned my lessons from before. I'm just going to get out. And I'm just going to bun it now, you know. Yeah, I'm bunning it now. I'm not even playing around with it. <laughs> Have you seen my last playthroughs? When I'm getting chased by um, by the enemies, the struggle is real. So you know what? We just shoot them, kill them quickly, and keep it moving. Well, that was fun. What are you doing smoking, huh? Come on. No, no, no. That's bad for you, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor, Listen, I've been meaning to... Uh, you know, I've been meaning to... I've been meaning to tell you, you know? I mean, what, homie? What have you been meaning to tell me, huh? <laughs> that you stabbed me in the back or that you were and always will be a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, no, what Clear the fuck did you come day. back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, no, no. One last score. Mm-hmm. And if it goes good, <laughs> guess what? I don't have to put a little bullet in your head. But if it goes bad, well, that's okay, too. Because then you and I get to go to hell. And I get to spend the rest of eternity with you, tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on, then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester. Let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Ooh, we're all friends now. Suppose the group hugs out of the question? <laughs> he wants to, uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty, depraved history, but history, nonetheless. All right. There. Good lesson. He's getting a hard one. Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. I mean, fair enough, man. Trevor did save save Michael's ass, so. Franklin living life. Oh, hey. Hey. What you doing here? I mean, I'm real glad you're here. Come here. Uh, come I can't on. stay. What's up, babe? No, it's Lamar. What that fool want now? It's your best friend. He's your best fucking friend. For real. My best friend. My homeboy, right? My nigga. Man, fuck you. I mean, not like that, man. But no, he ain't. He just another nigga from the hood. Him, stretching all the motherfucking clowns. All he want to do is drag a motherfucker down and live in the past. And this is the future? A big empty house with nobody who gives a fuck about you. Well, shit, it works for me. It can work for you, babe. I'm getting married, Franklin, to a doctor, not a murderer. Well, what the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm worried about Lamar. You got to help him, Franklin. Man, that shit is over. Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. <laughs> you a phony fuck. What? I ain't saying you got to marry the fool. I'm saying he's about to get killed over that deal you and him put on with... Stretcher set him up. Oh, fuck, man. My whole fucking life I've been looking after this motherfucker and paying a price afterwards. Fuck. Well, at least do it one more time, Franklin, for me. For you? For you and your doctor? I love you and Lamar. We grew up together, but this life ain't for me, and you knew that. You ain't changing. I don't care how many cars you own, how many apartments you own, I don't care how many diamonds you put in your ear, it ain't for me, not done bad or done good. Babe, look, I'll change. No, you won't, and that's fair enough, but at least respect what you do, who you are. If you let that idiot die, you a bigger asshole than I thought. Look, he's going up to some sawmill near Polito Bay. Ugh, you do what you got to do. Damn, we all going to save Lamar? Let's 
Oh, so there's one more, let's do it. Franklin, what's up? Hey, man, I'm in a bit of a bad situation. My boy Lamar got set up. I think he up near Polito Bay at some sawmill with some ballers. Could you, like, do some computer magic and look into it? Is that possible? What all? Uh, should be. I've got a back door into the Polito Bay police network left over from the score we did up there. Uh, give me a second here. Uh, hold on. Uh, uh, yes. So what it say? Huh. Uh, this must be it. Uh, there are older reports of a weed operation being run by an African-American gang. Uh, the files got buried, so uh, I'm guessing they paid off the cops. They growing weed up there? Growing it in the hills, most likely, but they might be packing and shipping it out of this sawmill. I'd expect a fair few of them up there. And I'm gonna need some help. Can you tell Mike and Trevor to meet me up there? They still aren't getting along that well. Tell them it's for me, and it's serious. Thanks, man. Well, let's see if they come, if we can gather, gather the band back together, you know? Oh, they here, they came. Yeah. That's love. Why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? That's we want love. Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, what's all <laughs> to shut the fuck up? Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. The place is crawling with ballers, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old gang warfare, but suede bucks over there. <laughs> yeah. Tell Trevor I said bite me. <laughs> man, I said shut up. Now I see the weed, but where the fuck is Lamar? Oh shit, there he go. You know what? Tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic. Classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh, fuck. I knew Stretch was gonna set him up, though. I'm gonna find a way in. Get into an assault position. Okay, so go to an enemy marks. I saw a few sure points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. Two, down the hill to my left. There's a bulldozer there. Might be able to use it in the assault. Three, the other side from me, by the railroad. Should be possible to avoid the worst of it that way. Here's where I'm making my play. I'm going right at him. All right, my turn to move. All right, I'm at the yeah, spot. We'll when the time comes, I'll do what I can from up here. I reckon our best shot is coming at him from two different directions. Maybe. Let's go over this side. Oh, he almost fell. <laughs> Got work on them legs, Franklin. Got work on them legs. All right, so there should be a, an assault path here, right? Right here. Oh, that's the bulldozer. Frank, Memories, right? On your Let's go find From the bank job. I'll take it I can. Here I come, Find them all. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Mobilize, motherfucker. This shit is on. Oh, we got guns blazing. Let's go. Are we gonna go to Trevor? We are. He's a Nutter, right? Let's go to him. You got a friend of ours! Frank! You found Lamar yet? No, don't! Just more balls! Lamar! Where's he at? Let's go, let's go. Wait. Let's go, big boy. Oh, we need to go switch back to Michael. I'm into Franklin. Lamar! Lamar! T, hey! You seen Lamar yet? No, I don't see him! Just guys wearing moves! Alright, let's go to Mike. Let's see what Mike's working with. I may have gone myself! Oh, Trevor. Okay, thanks to Trevor. Bring out Lamar! Let's go. Oh, 
Oh yes, loud. Chamberlain gangster families for life, motherfuckers! <laughs> Oh shit, he's almost dead. Let's go, Mike. That's... We got your back. We got your back. Headshot. Fuck, I just missed him. There we go. Get you as well, headshot in the bendy. Boom. All right, let's switch the mic. Shit, sniper. Hold tight. I might be able to get a shot. Give us the mouthy one and we'll be gone. Can we get him with Michael? Let's see where the sniper's at. I can't even see down there, honestly. Let's go with my, uh, to Franklin. Oh, shit. Let's go, Lamar. Let's go, Lamar. Yeah, huge coincidence, huh? Come on, man. There's more of them coming. A lot more. Move it, guys. Come on. Crazy dude here, too. Hey, Trevor. All right, Lamar. Let's go. <laughs> I bet you Lamar's happy to see each other, right? Oh, we got that as well. We got that minigun as well. Oh, yeah, we got that minigun as well. Oh, yeah, we got that minigun as well. We are walking. Oh, shit, we almost got banned. You got another guy hiding up there? Hey, dog, I'm all right. Don't think I owe you because you turned up to this shit. Nigga, I don't think shit. I'm doing this for my own peace of mind. Uh oh, Mike. Where's he at? Let's switch to. Get out All right, of there. Where's the last one at? Okay. I can't see this motherfucker. Where is he at? There's one more, but I can't see him. Oh, he's right here. In the dome. Beautiful. Nah, we fucked up like every car. Is we ever going to get a proper introduction, dog? All right, you two, go, 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 go. T, call me, dog. I'm gonna come up to the unicorn and get horny on your office supply. Shit, homie, you all right? I'm straight, homie. Bitch got to jump on me, though. I didn't get you to come all the way out here. Man, I ain't gonna let a little drive stand in the way of a money making opportunity. Or get killed, opportunity. Man, you always a pessimist. Nah, nigga, a realist. Because in reality, all them fools want to clap your ass. Man, what a trust that, dog. I peeped out that wood chopping place when we was up this way on that Devin Weston car lift, which I still ain't been paid for, incidentally. All secluded and shit. Stretch hit me up. I'm like, yeah, that's the perfect place to buy Kush by the bit. Nigga, perfect place to clap some fool you beefing with. Man, I ain't even know at the time. I just thought we was going to parlay. Parlay? Nigga, please. Every time you leave the house, fools try to clap. Every time 
very meet you set up. Homies there for the express purpose of clapping your ass. Man, you show? Sure? Cause I'm sure there's been a few times when... No, I'm completely 100% sure. Every time, nigga. Whether you buying drugs, selling drugs, or discussing drugs. Talking about the weather or whatever. Man, these streets is hard, dawg. This the hood you talking about. Maybe you forgot, since you've been uh, bettering yourself, sitting in that house on the hill, looking down on the animals in South Central and shit. Man, you know what, what you own, huh? You know it ain't like Do I, my nigga? Because that's the way it looked to me. I'm making the best out of what I'm giving. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't in some type of mentorship program. The only mentor I got... And we gonna do something about that, dawg. Trust me. Man, I ain't got people teaching me that white-collar crime shit. Ain't shit changed for me, and you ain't helping. Ain't helping? What the fuck you call this? Oh, here we me, go. Me, Michael, Trevor, we all came up here to help. The unholy fucking trinity. Ballers beware when these fools rolling together. You jealous of Michael and Trevor? What happened to me and you fucking shit up? Form gangsters, nigga. So I shouldn't have called them, right? Man, I was doing everything in my power to make sure you wasn't clap. I can make sure I ain't clap. Clearly you can't. Next time, homie, don't come. And as a matter of fact, if you do come, don't bring them dudes. Man, look, let's not talk next time. Lamar sounded next real unappreciative right now. That's right? crazy. It's the hood, Frank. That's what happens in the hood. No, the fuck it don't. Not for everyone. I'm one of them dudes that it happens to. Man, you gonna yeah, tell cause me you're what's a fucking jackass. Hood shit, homie. That's the shit that's different from the country club shit your overpaid ass is presently accustomed to. Man, stress put us on this shit, man. Man, we gonna get on his ass. Man, fuck that, homie. Look like I give a shit. Nigga, I give a shit. Stress do what he do. Niggas want me dead, be dead themselves. I ain't gonna overreact to shit. Overreact? Man, that nigga stress tried to get you killed, nigga. Nigga, that's the hood. I'm still here, ain't I? Just. You show sure Stress knew they was gonna book me? Yeah, nigga Stress knew. Everybody knew Stress knew. Tanisha knew Stress knew, and she don't even come around the fucking hood no more. Damn, that nigga Stress janky like... Yeah, Stress is a fucking nigga, see this? Man, shady guy. Nigga, don't from the start. Like from back in the day? From like the other day, dawg. Since after we went to the recycling place and D and them ballers try to take us down. But Stretch put in the work on D. Yeah, man, that's survival. Remember how angry his ass got? Especially with you bringing him into this shit? Aight, aight, but tell me this, though. If Stretch was fucking with your boy LD, why he set us up with the deal for the brick in the first place? He go off and make peace with the ballers, come back, and then put us on the lick on Grove Street. Man, you remember Grove Street? That brick was drywall. Ripping us off was probably Stretch's ideal anyway. Damn, you think so? It makes sense, don't it? Man, I ain't knowing, man, maybe. Man, Stress got yeah. in with the ballers when he was inside. Played us as Mark's dog, but a bunch of them got booked. So now they gotta come back at us. So Stress sends you out there where they doing a cush deal. Then you show up and save the day. Yeah, thankfully. Ooh, can we make it? Man, it wouldn't even be the same if your boy LD wasn't out here getting in the shit. And FC wasn't getting him out of it. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Man, I don't know. That shit was fun, nigga. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy scrapping like you did back in the day. It ain't back in the day no more, dawg. But it felt like it was. Okay, fool. It was fun saving your useless ass one more fucking time. There you go. That wasn't too hard. You should have seen your face when I came in. You was like, shit, shit, shit. Hey, shit, man. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> you better check them draws, homie. You probably shit it yourself. Fuck you, man. I don't care if I die. It's a compliment if they send an army after a nigga. They only send like two of the little homies to get you. Nigga, you didn't look like they was paying you no compliment, nigga. <laughs> Lamar is tapped. So I guess, I guess what Lamar we learned is, is fucking tapped. Nigga, don't think it ain't no fun if you had fucking with the homies, nigga. You feel me, my nigga? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, uh... You know your nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something? You know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here in the set. Oh, shit, my nigga. That's nothing. Shit, yeah. nigga. I know you done went all the Illuminati and shit. You know what I'm saying? Leaving the streets <laughs> in the back. But... <laughs> Damn, man. Uh, way to keep a nigga down, my nigga. I mean, thank you. <laughs> you payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting them cars and shit. You know what I'm talking about? 
Give a nigga just enough money to get him a little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the pole house, huh? <laughs> Don't be like that, dawg. Because number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. No matter for how real. many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours to try to get us killed, I Fucks. saved you, dawg. What are you supposed to, my nigga? I thought we was nah, homies nah. for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The best thing you can hope for is a big turn off of your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. What? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving your nigga in the backfield. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you would get some work. But instead, you want to be this game-banging, mad-dogging asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Card. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nigga, who you <laughs> think I am, nigga? Fuck you, Lamar. Nah, fuck you, F, nigga. I thought we was homies, nigga. But that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. You know what, dog? Wow. If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dog. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in the turf, nigga, if you remember where that is. Oh! What's up, player? Hello, Frank. Oh, my gosh. This man, guy, know, he's still fucking... We wow. Done, hey, we ain't done yet, homie. Not still yet. alive? Here. This motherfucker. Man, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill the president? Fuck his wife or something? Or invade some fucking country? No, no. Something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey. When the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out the pasture. Oh, me? Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us... No. Can no, 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 saved no. You. He saved both y'all ass. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. Fuck that. Man, get Michael to do it. Me and Trevor cool, dawg. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. Nah, we can't do each other, man. Hey, we can't do that? each other like that. Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Lost an ass, nigga. Damn, we can't do each other like that, man. Keep struggling, you heard? Yo, guys, that's going to be it for this one. I'm going to catch you on the next one, but I'm pissed right now. If we've got to kill each other, man, I'm not happy about that. I'm not happy about that at all, but I'm going to catch you on the next one. Peace out. One love.